Hi my lovelies, Assalamu alaikum. How are you all? Today we are going to Zurich. Every year in Zurich they host a variety of cultural events. To be honest, I actually don't know much about Swiss culture other than famous Swiss chocolate, cheese, what, cowbells and Swiss army knives. That's all about it really. I think since we're new in this country and planning to stay in Switzerland for a while, I think it will be wonderful to learn about their history, culture, custom. So let's go and enjoy our day. So to reach Zurich city center, we have to take a bus from our place to Winterthur Hauptbahnhof, which takes around 15 minutes. I'm looking forward to using public transportation here in Switzerland. Buses and trains are actually extremely reliable and runs very efficiently. Due to limited car parking, I think most people prefer to take the public transportation to go to Zurich rather than taking their own car. Here we are already in the train. Another 10 to 12 minutes and we should arrive in Zurich soon. My voice gets extremely excited about riding bus or trains. It was a pure joy for them. And to be honest, it was a wonderful ride. Now I understand why people enjoy taking those public transportation. It's extremely clean, well maintained, be it the toilet, seat, everything is very well kept. Here we are, Zurich train station. Once you are in Zurich train station, you are welcomed by this colourful sculpture done by a Latin American artist. The event we are attending is about five to ten minutes away from the Hauptbahnhof. Here we are entering the festival. Once I saw those children on the stage wearing the traditional costume, it just melt my heart. The intricate detail of the embroideries on their dresses were amazing. This little girl on stage was among the youngest, only two years old on the stage. She was spectacular. All the performers took so much pride to showcase their rich, diverse community. The energy on the stage and the rhythm in their dance steps was a complete delight to watch. Since Switzerland shares its border with neighboring country Germany, France and Italy, you can see the richness of those cultures intertwined with each other. Switzerland is also home to many immigrant families. Many come from Italy, Germany, former Yugoslavia, Albania, Portugal and Turkey. Here we are enjoying sample of some Albanian folk dance. This group is dancing traditional folk dance from Kosovo. It was also wonderful to see other tradition and culture kept their identity, individuality alive through their art and music. This is the traditional Aztec a dance from the native Mexican Indian people.
Towards the end of the show, people were welcomed on stage to come and dance and learn some traditional folk dance, which was really, really wonderful to see. Beside the international folk dance, the event also hosted a variety of international food. Here you can see some Tibetan food from Ethiopia, which was very interesting. I never tried Ethiopian food. Some crepes, good for Hamid. This one was gluten and lactose fry. After our delicious lunch, we just relaxed, enjoyed the view. Zuc Lake is just breathtaking. We played a little game, saw some parents enjoying their time with their children too. And slowly our day comes to an end. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed my video. Thank you.